and Namibia has for some time been making headlines in the local media for all the wrong reasons, such as financial incapacity, court cases and labor matters, among others. It is also an open secret that government made significant losses in bailing out the national airline. The paradox has now hit the threshold and President Gengop, when responded to question during his State of the Nation address, expressly said Namibia should brace itself for possible restructuring or liquidation. However, Natau is of the opinion that liquidation is not an ideal option now considering the impact it might have on job losses. We understand the frustration of His Ex Excellency Dr. Hage Gengo, the President of the Republic of Namibia. The national airline contributes significantly to the GDP in one way or the other. The move to close it down is not a wise one at the moment. The airline is not a burden to the state coffers, but management and board who have been entrusted to manage and directed failed to fulfill their mandate. But the union was quick to point out that mismanagement of funds, incompetency, lack of clear business plan, as well as lack of transparency and accountability could be some of the contributing factors to the downfall of the airline. Natau also wants aircraft leasing deals, appointments of expatriates and their remuneration and financial audits of the company to be laid bare. Daniel Nadunya, NBC News, Vent Hook.